So let's talk about bone grafts and when you need them. Now you'll hear different opinions depending on the doctor, but I'll give you my take. My philosophy is simple, better safe than sorry. If it's a front tooth, I almost always recommend a bone graft. Why? Because in the front of the mouth, the bone is thinner. From the lip side to the tongue side, it's just the small amount of bone holding everything together. So if I pull that front tooth and immediately place an implant without adding bone, that's riskier. A graft gives us more stability and helps ensure the implant lasts. Second, if there's a larger defect or bone loss, Maybe you've been missing the tooth for a while. A graft is usually the way to go. It rebuilds the space so that implants have something solid to hold on to. Now, here's the part most people don't know. There are times when a bone graft just won't work. If too many walls of bone are missing, basically if the graft has nothing to hold on to, it won't heal well. But if we're working with, for example, like I extract a tooth, right? Where there's bone that surrounds that space and then I pack bone into it, that's a great environment for a graft to heal. So the truth is it depends on the situation, but in the chair, front tooth or anywhere with bone loss, I'm usually grafting because I'd rather build a strong foundation now than deal with a failed implant later.